domination, mass executions of civilian populations, the eradication of religious institutions, the censorship of artists and philosophers, all can and have been justified in the name of achieving communism. And yet, communism itself remains conspicuously unachieved. Moreover, the Marxist vision of communism simply cannot be achieved, any more so than capitalism can ever produce enough to satisfy its endless demand for economic growth. The Marxist vision is unachievable because culture, the spiritual dimensions of human existence, does not simply grow out from relations of material production. It is unachievable because you do not own yourself or your labor. You belong to a family, a community, a culture, a language. Your labor belongs to the form of life which produced you and which we all strive to sustain and perpetuate. Your body and labor belong to the earth and to the life world which lives through you and through the earth. It is this very sense of belonging which both capitalism and Marxism annihilate. And it is here that we see the fundamental contradiction between these ideological frameworks and the reality of human existence. In order to move beyond these ideologies and thus to move beyond the nightmares of the 20th century, and the nightmares of the modern consumerist hell world, we must be willing to think beyond the individual ego, beyond the merely material. We must reclaim our sense of human existence as constituted fundamentally by mutual obligation, higher purpose, and our grounding within a living, breathing reality.